Arsenal were made to fight for all three points against Fulham on Saturday. Arsenal boss Mikel Arteta proved he does have a plan B in the 2-1 comeback win over Fulham if things aren't going his way, but more may be needed to make it a viable option on a regular basis. The Gunners dominated the game in the opening 45 minutes and should have taken their chances, but Fulham frustrated the hosts with some solid defending. Anthony Robinson kept Bukayo Saka quiet on one side while Gabriel Jesus and Gabriel Martinelli struggled to find the final product. Arsenal would have still felt content with their first half displays despite going in at the break goalless. But that good mood quickly shifted to every Arsenal fan holding their head in their hands after Gabriel's horror error. Taking too long on the ball in his own box, Gabriel had the ball stripped off him by a lurking Alexander Mitrovic. Who finished expertly to give the hosts an unexpected lead. Arteta wasted no time in changing things up in response to his side going down, taking off Kieran Tierney for Eddie Enkedia. The bold attacking substitution switched things up for Arteta up front with Jesus now joined by Enkedia through the middle while Martinelli and Saka switched wings. The plan B appeared to work as Fulham tried to adjust to Arsenal's new formation. Minutes later and Martin Odegaard leveled, although fortuitously, with a deflected long-range effort. The winner didn't look like it would come despite Arsenal's best efforts and Enkedia was a focal point for their attacking threat. But it was Gabriel who went from zero to hero in the final few minutes with a scrappy winner just a few yards out after a corner. Arteta can take credit for his bold attacking substitution paying dividends in the end, but it was far from perfect. Apart from Enkedia, Arsenal lacked any other real attacking options on the bench other than Emile Smith-Rowe, who was an unused substitute in the end. Neither Fabio Vieira or Albert Sambi Lokanga came on either while Marquinhos is seen as one for the future. It proved to be enough against Fulham but on another day, Arteta may need stronger options off the bench to help implement his plan B for the match.